Frozen. Yeah. And finally, moving back to the winner's side of things, mm -hmm. we have the Jersey Three, players. Two, one, I'm sorry, that was rude. That, the that was, the that Jersey was, players. The, the Jersey boys holding it down here in winner's finals. Yeah, winner's one of these players finals. guaranteed top two, both of them mm -hmm. top three. Yep, and neither have uh, qualified for the $5,000 pop bonus invitational. So uh, this is good for both of them. Yeah, they're both they're both uh, auto qualified actually, automatically. Clap it up for him. Yeah, nice job. But here we go. Uh, Jackal rocking the wolf. Uh, he's gone through a couple of characters in this game. I've seen him play Pichu. I've seen him play Wolf. I've seen him play uh, Pokemon Trainer. I've seen him uh, without the Sonic. I'm, I I think I've even seen him like play Little Mac. If I'm not mistaken, he's yeah, tried yeah, a Little what, Mac what, as well. What drugs was he on? I have no idea. I never. I want to see the Little Mac. I could be wrong though. Nonetheless, it's the Wolf here, and it's doing great against Look, for, uh, his, for his sake, I hope you're wrong. Mm -hmm. But yeah, taking a little bit of a break from the Pichu. As he still does mess around with Pichu, plays him a little bit more of a counterpick character. He's yeah. focusing a lot on Wolf nowadays, yeah. at least for yeah. the past couple of weeks. And his Wolf, already good enough to get to Winner's Finals of this yes. stacked Legacy Tournament. Yes. Just really just a true testament to his skill. And I mean, Wolf is a pretty basic character. Uh, his approaches don't really change. So if you have really good fundamentals, you can be really good with Wolf. Yeah, I think both of these characters are like, with all due respect to like, you know, both these players, I think they're two of the easiest top tiers to play. Ooh, or like two of the most consistent top tiers to play. Yeah. They both have wonderful neutral areas. Yeah. I would say these two characters and Ike. For sure. Yeah, oh, you're dead. Yeah, you're dead. Got your jump clipped. And just like that, Palutena able to turn the tide. You were just saying last game how much of a com comeback factor she has. And even before I can finish my sentence about how great uh, Palutena has a comeback factor, she loses that stock. So we got an even game between Gons and uh, Jackal right now. We've definitely been, like, kissing Palutena's feet for, like, the past, like, 15 minutes <laughs> so far, like, talking about how amazing this character is. But Wolf, uh, of course, one of yes. his own. And Palutena can also just do this. Yep. Let's imagine you know how laggy that was in the last game, man. Yeah. Look at that. She had... Uh, Jackal had no jump in that uh, situation, so he wasn't able to do anything. Back hit of Nair gonna clip the um, the counter from Palutena. Palutena, uh, just truly a hollow shell of what she once was. <laughs> Honestly, God, in like a good way, you know. Ooh, yeah, with a run up, definitely jab. not the same. Run up grab coming out from uh, coming out from Jackal gonna be able to get some good damage right there. And look at that in disadvantage. Palutena still able to press buttons to get herself out, which is so good. And ah, the DI. I feel like he could have survived that. Actually, he DI'd that away, and he was on the right side of the explosive flame. I think that yeah. DI was actually optimal. Otherwise, he would have gone straight up. But going straight up might have not killed. Yeah, so that's I don't what know I'm saying. It, it looked like he died on on the right side of the blast zone. So maybe honestly, I'm gonna be real. A little bit. I'm gonna be real confident. I think he just got caught in a really bad spot to get hit by yeah. explosive flame. Yeah. He should have jumped right there, but unfortunately, he just wasn't, uh, wasn't aware of the situation completely yet, or just perhaps there was not much he could do about it. Yep. And Wolves love to do that. They love to forward throw and then just double jump there. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> there was no way you were surviving that um, that <laughs> down smash. Yo. Yeah, absolutely not. Gon's throwing him off stage, trying to intercept him with the neutral B again. Not going to be able to do it. Now just looking for a neutral air to be able to take the stock, trying to get the down throw to the bear, but unfortunately, he runs out of stage to be able to get the reverse aerial yeah. rush on. Now, and actually, like, Gons did the tech where you just run off stage and immediately air dodge back in Waveland. Yeah. I love that. It's, it's cool. Yeah. I mean, you could, you could get called out for it, but definitely a good mix-up. Yeah, I don't think it's that useful, but it's just it's cool looking. It's just one of those things to, like, it's one of those buttons to, like, spam an advantage. You know, like multi-shining. And I think as the meta goes, back throw, throw going to do it. Game. Not Ooh, yet. Never nice. mind. Good DI. Great, great DI on that one. And oh, you're yeah. done. Yeah. Pichu. <laughs> Pichu. Good night. Jackal, Jack, Jackal, Jackal, Pichu. You died to that twice in one game. Pichu. I think he does it. I think he I think he tries to Pichu. Yeah. I don't know, man. He's, He's either going to uh, go out with this one, Wolf, straight Wolf, um, and if he gets to the run back, start Pichu, or he might try Pichu. Right he now. has been staying pretty consistent with Wolf all day. But you if know. we don't see Pichu here, we're not seeing Pichu at all. Yep, in there this, it is. In this winner's final Pichu's set. Pichu's dead. <laughs> Ding dong the witch. Unless he gets three stock. If he gets three stock, he might try that. Yeah, unless Gon's like, you know, for, like body, 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 body bags. Yeah. Which Let's I don't think is going to happen. Me either. Then we're going to see the switch. Oh, no, here's the start of the body, okay. body, oh, body, 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 body. Okay, good air dodge. Gon's not able to reset it. Um, Such a bad witch. With the grab. Mm, okay. Now you see Gon's has a game plan now. He's just going to kind of camp um, his explosive flame and auto reticle until he approaches how all wolves approach, jump, and he's going to anti-air him with Nair. Mm. That is the strat right now. So let's see if let's see if uh, Jack was able to um, I have a counteract heart. that. I have a heart attack every time Wolf down smashes by the ledge. Yo, it's so, it's so big, man. Ooh, how do you that get down? Killed. I don't think he has a jump. Okay, fair. Put a fair and dis at a disadvantage, put himself in uh, stage control. But that back here, going to eat it. 
take. Daz Dak putting him back in the air. No up air, though. Okay. Strong neutral being played right now. Neither one to get hit because it could uh, prove to be fatal by both of them. 123 staying on Jackal. Just going to jump over that. But he's going to catch his landing with the dash attack, which is really good. Mm -hmm. Really good. There we go. There's the neutral air to force his way back. Mm -hmm. Dash attack not going to do it just yet. That move was actually nerfed and knocked back from this game to the last. Yep. And that up, trying to challenge Wolf's up B, definitely, it, it's, it's almost like the new Ness up B. Like, if you, if you challenge it wrong, like, I actually bro. compared it to Ness's up B a little bit earlier in terms that it just doesn't go very far, but that it kills. Yeah. Wonky percent it yeah. kills. Yeah, like, and even if you're on the standing at the edge of the stage, like, you will get you will get clipped off the stage. Like, you yoinked off the, the side of the stage. I mean, like, Ness, again, it absolutely compensates for, like, you know, how, you know, kind of bad Wolf's recovery is, at least yeah. in terms of distance, you know. It's one of, like, his only real flaws as a character, at least currently in the meta. Yeah, I would agree. Okay. Don's option to just uh, teleport to the middle of the stage. Definitely a great option for uh, great option for uh, Palutena in disadvantage. So, oh, and the dash attack. Okay, Not it dodges really to the edge of the stage. Really good. And uh, Jackal just eating all these dash attacks, man. He's uh, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know. He just isn't shielding, and he's just getting his landing caught as well. Okay, back throw. Turn Not going to kill yet. Yeah, oh, that, that DI was bad, though, because he went straight back. The last time he actually he held up and he was able to go to the corner, but nonetheless, even stocks once again. Let's back see if Jackal could, uh, Jackal could uh, opt this comeback because he was down early. The Great Gonzalez pressing plenty of button, but no punish coming out from Jackal. Okay. Uh, oh, and you have no jump. Too many times Jackal's getting caught in the air uh, against uh, Gons with no jump. Gaunt's forcing his advantage a little bit, not pressing any button, just going to the other side of the stage. But now he's off stage because of it. You don't want to get gimped here. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. That down smash is a thing. He showed you that he will clip your up B with, uh, with that down smash. Okay. Oh, nice. Going to shield that one, but got caught overextending. Going to eat that forward smash. Now you're off the stage. Auto reticle. Okay. Good job. He was a That time he was able to make it towards the, um, the bottom drop zone. So the auto reticle wasn't able to um, lock, lock in on him. Oh, and what a smash nice board. Pivot, pivot grab. grab. If there's anybody who's going to be good at pivot grabbing in this game, <laughs> it's, it's, it's absolutely going to be Gons. <laughs> that was really nice. Absolutely. Okay. Nonetheless, Wolf, this Wolf right here seems a little confident. A back air will do it. That's and, safe on block. And he has some momentum. And Gons not even, doesn't even want to uh, uh, try and punish that. Okay. Tries to uh, F tilt. Not going to get it. Yeah, warping the heck out of there. Mm. Going to get the grab. Not going to do it. Not enough percent on the Great Gonzalez, then the falling explosive oh. flame. That's a thing. Yes. Sometimes Palutainers will just do that on the Absolutely. way down, and they still have time to be able to up E back. Why is this character yes. so good? They're really good, man. Let me just put out this kill box right here while you're not paying attention. It's insane. And the reason why Gons was able to do that is because Wolf can't go off stage. Wolf doesn't, I mean, he could do the, his nair is pretty good. It's a long lasting hitbox that could clip it. But. If he gets hit with anything off the stage, you're dead. My you're mans. dying at 30. My mans, Goffinen, spitting the straight facts about uh, Palutena I mean, right there. You're absolutely right. What is Wolf going to do? Yes, he's, he's going to run off stage. Can, and I guess I feel like that's why I'm not afraid of Wolf as a Roy main, because he's not going to get me. Yeah. <laughs> what is he going to do? Yeah. He, he can't do that. He cannot go off the stage. He Wolf has to win this game on standing on the stage or um, getting that down smash, uh, which is really good. Silly Wolves. Gimps are for Palus. <laughs> Gimps are for not you. <laughs> <laughs> Gimps are for not you. But Wolf, of course, still an amazing character. Sort yeah. of a monster off stage, yes. on stage if played properly. Yes. A Jackal, of course, won as well. But he is now down 2-0 against the Great Gonzalez, who is just doing a really solid job of playing around this Wolf. I mean, the Wolf is still relative as a back air, not going to do it, just Ooh. barely not doing it. The knockback yes. growth of that move is insane. And both of them, Jackal and Gons, playing very patient. They're kind of like reacting. They're not really like throwing out preemptive hitboxes. They're kind of just seeing where they're going and, and reacting to those options. Yeah, absolutely. I was just going to say, you know, I mean, the Wolf isn't like new. It's that L-Tilt is going to be able to do it. But Jackal, yes. of course, has been playing Pichu for just a little bit longer. Mayhaps his Wolf is not completely perfect yet. But yes. we'll see what this guy is going to be able to do. We've seen plenty of reverse 3-0 before. You never know. Okay, and you see Gon's trying to get these counters here, but uh, Jackal not biting on the bait at all. Okay. Nice, Dash Dad gonna clip that uh, warp cancel or that warp to the middle of the stage. 
He tried to land with uh, Nair just now, but Dash Attack just gonna destroy it. Like, bro, Dash Attack eats just about everything. Mm -hmm. Okay. Not back there, gonna be able to do it, even out the stocks real quick. Yes, you don't wanna uh, get caught grabbing or whiffing a grab in this game. If they uh, spot dodge or roll behind you or whatever, like, you're, you're eat, you can eat a forward smash by almost every character in this game. Yeah, this game is so much more about neutral than the last one was, and when the last one was so much more about grabs. Uh -huh. So if you play, like, grappler characters, you know, like I used to do, you better you better work those out of your habits real quick. Yes. You know, you don't want to be grabbing too much in this game. Only when you know you can. Yep. Especially because shield is so much uh, so much worse in this game. Nonetheless, Jackal off the stage right now. The spacing. Is that it? Oh, oh my okay. god. That was almost really, really bad for yes. Jackal. But Jackal keeping his composure, fighting his way back on stage, and able to get the stock because of it. Yep, because he had a really, really strong lead. So if he, if he was giving... If he gave Gans that stock that early, it would have completely turned the tide of, of, of the match. Absolutely. Okay, Gans is playing this turtle game, trying to make him see... See if uh, he can force Jackal to come to him. He can't even, but, um, he can't even reflect that. The, the, yeah. It's going right above her head. Yeah. Look at that. It's going right above her head. Why is that move so good? Mm, Why does that, that send that kind of angle on the do back it. throw? Even game. He took the bait. Gans is so, like, in situations like that, players who do that, they kind of play that, what we call the lame play style. They kind of break eventually. Gans's willpower to play that lame game is second to... Maybe the buzz. <laughs> but yeah. even then, it's still arguable. Because in that situation, Gans, all he did was throw auto reticle like seven times. Walked forward a couple of steps, threw another one, and then forced uh, Jackal to come towards him. Mm -hmm. So, uh, but just like that, you can see Jackal pretty angry right now. 128 sitting on uh, the Great Gonzalez. Is this going to kill? No. No, okay. he's going to DI that away. Yes. You're always going to want to DI that away. That's not a... Uh, that's not a uh, that's not a grab mix up there. It's like, okay. uh, not a grab. That's not a DI mix up there. Because if you DI away, is that up tilt is going to be able to take the stock. Jackal nice. putting himself on the board. Forward throw is not going to kill you no matter what. Yeah. That move has like no knockback. But back throw will. So you always want to DI like in the direction that Wolf is facing. No matter what. It's just safer that way. Yeah. And I don't know what that was, whether it's a dash attack or a whiff grab. But um, definitely going to get punished by Wolf uh, in a situation like that. I think that was even just up tilt that... Uh, that took the stock. Absolutely. Yeah, the punt. Uh, Wolf is actually um, the kicker for the New York Giants. What? Hmm? What? He is absolutely the kicker for the New York Giants. You don't uh -oh. see his dash attack and up to? It's good. Dude, That's uh -oh. what we're going to call it. The Dude. it's good. <laughs> oh, my Down God. throw. Down throw. It's good. Dude, I'm mad. I'm mad. <laughs> you, you made Devin laugh. Devin just shakes his head at my chunks. I've, I, I don't think I've ever seen Devin laugh at a commentator. Oh, I've def no, he, he, I've gotten him once or twice. I've seen, no, no, no. I've, I don't think I've ever seen him laugh at a commentator joke, but I've seen him laugh at commentators before. <laughs> as mean as that sounds. But Devin's a good guy. But 62% sitting on uh, Jack right now, and you're off stage. How do you make it back? Air read twice, and he put the explosive flame mm, in the right spot. Still too. have no, no jump. jump. Oh, uh, okay. Yo, I, yo, I'm not going to lie. If I was gone, I would have just done it. I would have ran off there. Absolutely. Why not? Why not? Take that stock super early. Send at 58%. But, I mean, he took it anyways. Going to read that jump with back air. Nice job by uh by Jackal. Bad situation to be in, though. Okay. Down so. throw. Fair. That other fair going to miss. Trying to, clip, trying to clip him with an air, but uh, doesn't get anything from it. I hate to stop your train of thought, but it is 2-1, correct? Yes. Okay, yeah, no. just making sure. Oh, wait. We were keeping track. No, it's just like he wasn't sure either the score was wrong for like a second. Yeah, there we go. Unless they don't shake hands after Gons wins this season. They were all morons. Anyway. Yeah, now that you oh, say that, I don't know. Uh... We'll, we'll figure it out in a sec. I was, I'm pretty sure it's I'm pretty sure it's too long. But uh, regardless. Okay. Let's just pretend this is game four. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the up air going to do it right there. 70%. 85. And 96. Mm -hmm. Already tacked on, 102, staying on the ledge just Down a two. little too long. And that and that move will clip you, man. Like you cannot stay under uh, at the ledge long in this game. No, you can't. Yeah, a lot, start, a lot of stuff hits ledge. Once you start hitting about that 80, 90, 100 percent, like your ledge invisibility, it's, it's not uh doesn't stay very long, in man. Before I was just doing it to people, man. I'm like Mario. I just ran up and dash attacked. Everyone now has Mario dash attack at the ledge. Yeah. Ooh, just going right underneath those auto reticles. If he got clipped by one, he probably would have died. With no jump off the stage. Mm -hmm. I just okay. slowly but surely tacking on that damage is Jackal. 
and he has to do that right now. There's about 100% deficit between these two players right now. He needs to get something cooking if he wants to. He doesn't want to lose the stock, With which he grab. might. No, nah, not yet. And look at that, 148, and he still didn't, he wasn't dead. That nair going to do it, though. I feel like that move should not kill. Yeah, it definitely shouldn't. But that's a conversation that everyone's having all across America. <laughs> <laughs> all across America? All across America. All and across the in, world. And even in Europe. Japan, not so much. <laughs> all across the world, my friend. But that's a debate for another time. Like, uh, just how do we nerf Palutena's Nair? Exactly. Anyway. Okay, trying to make it back to the stage. Uh, tries to get a field goal kick. Um, <laughs> yeah, tried, tried, my man that. tried to hit him with the Charlie Brown. <laughs> <laughs> but ah! completely did it. Completely hit him with the Charlie Brown because it whipped. Okay. <laughs> Kick not good. Ah, okay. You see that comic of like Goku like playing football with Charlie Brown? I did not. Oh, it's amazing. I'll, I'll show it to you later. Yes. Okay. Now, uh, Jackal allowing Gans to live pretty long here. Uh, Gans at 133%, well, but he still has two stocks. Jackal on his last stock. So a lot of rage stains can, uh, can uh, kill you right now. And it's good. It's good. <laughs> the explosive flame coming off of that. Yo, he's yes. just waiting. He waited. With that. He tried to wait for an option. Jackal not giving it to him, knowing the situation he's in. Don't get gimped here. Don't get gimped here. Yes. And Wolf hits very hard, so nice job. I like it. Before, in the last game, uh, Jackal got caught jumping pretty early. So he was able to hit him with the auto reticle. That time, he kind of dropped down, but that up air. No That's jump. Be able to do it. Gons just kept forcing Jackal low, and it yes. was game four, by the way. It was. Good just ball. kept forcing him low with the not just with the explosive flame, but with the neutral B, the recovery, so exploitable, and then just catching him with that up air mm -hmm. hitbox. Gons just earned himself a trip to the grand finals yes. winner side. Guaranteed time. Look and how big. the last hit. Look how big that uh, up air is. That move is amazing. That is insane, man. And, and not only does it do that, but if you were to air dodge that last hit only, Palutena would have uh, the FAF on that move is low enough where she would have frame trapped him. So it's like, you can't win.